Anyways, um, right now what I did was I, I just went with a paper towel and cleaned off the lube from all these pieces, just like that, you know, cleaned off all the pieces. Still got to do like this last one, but um, this is an experiment because I've never lubed a core like this at all. Nothing like this. And uh, so I'm going to see what I can do because I don't know. I don't want to. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, so let me clean this off a little bit, and I'm just gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use weight 5 lube on the core, and, um, uh, and weight 2 for the pieces a little bit. The pieces I'll do the same way I always do my cubes, uh, and I have a tutorial on how, how I lube my cubes, um, already uploaded, so, uh, if you want to learn how to, like, uh, lube normal cubes, um, go... Go and watch that video. Um, but right now, let me get this out of here. Right now, I'm, this is an experiment on what I'm going to do with this and see if I like it. So I'm going to take a little bit of weight five. Okay, a little bit of weight five, and just put it on the springs and uh, screw in here. I'm gonna do that for each of them. Okay. Two more to go. Okay, once you've done that, just gotten a little bit of lube in the springs and screwing in, in there, uh, you're going to want to start reassembling your cube. You can do that because by, you just want to get one edge, edge piece in and then the rest will be easy. You just got to pull this out, pop that in, and then they'll pull these pieces out. And then that should make it a lot easier. Uh-oh, man, I suck at this. Yeah, and then just try and get another one in there you go find another edge piece try to get this one in wow I'm ridiculously bad at this <laughs> this would be so much easier if I could get my center caps on but whatever Give it the hard way all right let's get that's three of them. Once you get all four of them in, it should be fairly easy. Ah, never going to be easy. <laughs> uh, so what I'm going to do, actually, is I'm just going to have to get these on. There we go. So I'm going to put all my caps on. So that's easier to put back together. Okay, and at this point, uh, I don't know. Yeah, I might as well put a little bit on just each of these pieces in here. Right in there. I'm just gonna put it in right there. Because again, this is an experiment, so why not? Okay, now let's uh, just pop these edge pieces in, slide that one in, slide this one in, start working on the bottom layer. And once you have all these bottom four in, it's easy to finish the bottom layer, if you can get the bottom four in, because I'm incapable. Uh, then it's easy to put the corners in, because all you have to do is uh, just put that in there, 
and slide it down. Same with all the rest. Put it in there, slide it down. Put it in there, slide it down. Put it in there, slide it down. And then at this point, what I normally do is I normally, I'll take some weight to cubicle silicone lube and I put it in this little crevice. So I'm gonna put it in this little crevice here. Oh, that's a lot. Eh. Let's get some of that out of there. And then I put just a dab on here. Hold on. Do not put that much. I don't want that much. Okay, let's try that again. So this is about enough. There's just a little there and a little there. And then down here, same thing. Just get a little bit in there. And just a dab on this piece. And then slide it in. Okay. And find another edge and do the same thing. Just a little a smidge and the little crease right here, a smidge on here, and the other side, a smidge in here, a smidge in here. Do that for four of the pieces, but leave one out. You'll see what I mean in a second. Okay, so for this last one, do the same thing the same thing but uh take it and set it off to the side on like a paper towel or something like that so that uh you because you want to put the top layer in now because that will make it easier so we're just going to go ahead take a corner and use this open space pop the corner in pop an edge corner that didn't go in very well there we go edge Corner. Eh, can't get it in right. Edge. And then. And somehow I managed to lose a piece, but. Oh. Okay, it was right on the floor. So I'll leave two pieces out and then put this one back in. So take this one, and pop this one in here. And then you're going to want to pop this glass corner in, like so. And then let's pop this last edge in. Okay, and now you just want to get this crap, this lube off your hands. As much as you can, really, I guess. And um, play around with it. All right, so I'm actually already liking this feel. This feels really good. Let's get the centers going. Okay, so we're just. Break it in a little bit, and then, uh, yeah. So that's my experiment, and I love how it turned out. Love it. This is great. Worked really well. So I'm really happy with uh, that experiment, so don't know if I'm going to label it as an experiment or not, because it actually turned out well, and I guess that's what you want. So, yeah, so that's how I would lube my GANS 356, and now I'm going to sticker it because I'm really excited and I'm just gonna like solve the crap out of it. So, you know, have a, a great day and go and get yourself one of these cubes. I know they're expensive. They are very expensive for a cube, but I don't wanna say it's worth it because it it is a sturdy cube and it's probably gonna last you a long time. And, you know, I know it's smaller than the 357, but it, I mean, it's one millimeter. It doesn't even feel smaller. So, uh, thanks guys, and uh, yeah, check out more of my videos if you want, and uh, hit the subscribe button if you uh, like my videos, because there's going to be plenty more where that came from, because I just enjoy this so much. Alright, thanks.